up everyone what is up this is julie here and welcome to my youtube channel if you have not yet subscribed please smash that subscribe button kick the like button on this video and, and on all of my other videos and don't forget ring that notification bell so you'll be notified whenever i upload new content hey this is a special request video uh, one of my subscribers asked if i could perform or demonstrate how to uh, perform the skill assist with use of bedpan uninterrupted as I did so with the previous peri care video and so that's what I'm going to do today okay no explanations there is one key point that I want to make before I do get started and that is this skill assist with use of bedpan is performed on a live person okay a live person but for training purposes and for this training video, I'll be performing this skill on our mannequin, Mrs. Jones, okay? But just remember, it is performed on a live person. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Good morning, Mrs. Jones. My name is Julie. I'm your CNA, and today I'm going to help you get on the bedpan, okay? But first, I'm going to do a brief safety check. I want to make sure your bed is in a low safe position, and I'm going to go ahead and lower it just a wee bit more. And then I'm going to lower your head of bed, okay, because I need you in supine position uh, for this skill. So I'm lowering your head of bed. You doing okay? All right. And I'm just going to make sure that the bed breaks are locked. I'm going to give you your call light in your hand and provide you with privacy. Mrs. Jones, I'm going to go wash my hands and gather my supplies and I'll be right back, okay? Hi, Mrs. Jones. It's me, Julie, your CNA. I'm back with my supplies. I'm just going to go ahead and get them laid out on the table. I'm putting on my gloves. And once I get my gloves on, I'm going to go ahead and assist you with getting on the bedpan, okay? Just going to make sure that I have placed the bedpan correctly with the narrow end facing the footboard and the wide end facing the headboard. And to ensure that I do not overexpose you, Mrs. Jones, I'm just going to lift your gown and your sheet. And if you could raise your hips for me. Okay, there we go. All right, I'm going to remove my gloves without self-contaminating myself washing hands now i'm just going to raise your bed okay your head of bed to get you in a most comfortable position for uh eliminating okay so you can use the restroom as i raise you up mrs jones if you need to reposition yourself to get a little bit more comfortable you can do so okay all right okay mrs jones I have your toilet paper and also your hand wipes. The hand wipes are for you to use when you're done, okay? Um, and I would like for you to ring your bell um, when you, you're ready for me to come back in, all right? I'm gonna step behind your curtains just to give you some privacy and just ring your bell when you're ready. Ding, ding. Hi, Mrs. Jones, I heard your call light. I am back. I'm going to lower your head of bed before I remove the bed pad, okay? You doing okay? All right. All right, Mrs. Jones, I've lowered your head of bed. Now I'm going to put on a clean pair of gloves. 
And to make sure I don't overexpose you as I did when I placed the bedpan, I'm just going to raise your gown and glove. And if you could raise your hips for me and I'm going to remove the bedpan. There we go. Good job. Okay, Mrs. Jones, um, before I leave, I just want to make sure that your bed is still in the low safe position. Bed wheels are locked. You have your call light in your hand. Privacy is maintained. I'm going to go dispose of my supplies and I'll be right back, okay? All right, I'm going to place my wipes and toilet paper in the designated dirty area. I'm going to empty the bedpan into the toilet. I'm going to rinse the bedpan and empty the rinse into the toilet. I'm going to place the bedpan in the designated dirty area. I'm going to remove my gloves without self-contaminating myself. Washing hands, skill complete. All right guys, so that is it, okay? Um, assist with use of bedpan um, for Pearson View testers, okay? Um, and again, this skill is performed on a live person, but for training purposes in this training video, I demonstrated this skill on our mannequin, Mrs. Jones. But for testing, you will test on a live person. All right, guys, that's it. Um, again, if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please, please smash that subscribe button, okay? I'm getting a lot of views from unsubscribed uh, people, okay? So if you're watching my videos, subscribe. Yes, subscribe. Kick the like button on this video and all of my other videos. And don't forget to ring that notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I upload new content. Hey, I want to give a huge and enormous shout out for all of you folks who are passing your nurse aid certification exam, man, I'm getting um, comments and responses on a daily basis now with people, um, you know, letting me know that they have passed their state certification exam. So good job, folks. Keep up the good work and I'll see you all later. If you have any questions or comments, comment down below, okay? Thank you.